Orlando that are north of 25 points and shooting 50% from three, the offenses have been pretty good. There have been some wild offensive numbers as we're set to go. For Junior, over to Murray. Murray coming back from a hamstring injury. Jokic for three. This guy is just so good. Three and three and the restart, but both teams have not played with a full deck with injuries and COVID-related illnesses as Kawhi Leonard nails the jump there. In terms of trying to just, it seems like every team yeah. or most of the elite teams have one player at least. There's Murray, nice smooth jumper there. He had been shooting extremely well the last several games. Millsap to Jogic. That was an interesting move and pass, <laughs> but it results in a bucket. Going to determine whether or not they win, and both their defenses have been subpar at times during this bubble. And I, I think it's really almost feels like across the board, too much fouling across the board. Something both of these teams do well. Offensive rebound, second chance points. There's their first opportunity. Great cut by Jamal Murray. Jokic ducks under, can't get the first time, the second one is good, and gets the foul, so a chance for a three-point play for Jokic. Leads you to believe they believe long-term in his, you know, in his future, as a sidekick to Jokic. I thought they needed one more piece, quickly they came together in Toronto. Well, a lot of the same scenario like that with the Clippers, nice feed inside, Jokic finishes, a post-up had the mismatch. Morris inside, Jokic finds Porter for the land. That extra pass. Jermichael Green can't connect. Jokic throws it down court. Porter able to catch, lay it up and in. For the stoppage, but felt that there was still so much that he needed to learn about the NBA game. So with the four and a half months off, he said he got to do that. He was back in Missouri. Bad pass by George, though. Look at Bull handle a ball down the lane and throw it down. How about that for the big man? A little coast-to-coast -coast action. Come on now. Can you imagine when this guy gets real strength in his base? That's a 7-2 guy doing that. Lou Williams <laughs> with wow. Bull in his face from several feet behind the arc. This, as you can tell from the virtual fans' chant, Nuggets considered a Nuggets home game. Reggie Jackson ball fake to get rid of the defender. Half gone by second quarter. Nuggets and the Clippers. Grant, oh! An emphatic finish from Grant. Again, both these coaches, when, when they get fully healthy, is Bowl Bowl hits the three. He has shown he's got a beautiful stroke from downtown. And he's already made an impact in this game. Paul George answers with a three-pointer. Jokic back in. Craig, Millsap, Jamal Murray, and Grant. Torrey Craig using the left hand, draws the foul, and a chance for a three-point play. Leonard guarding by Grant. Grant is a very good, versatile defender. Leonard just happens to be a very good offensive player. Right. With championship aspirations. There was nobody here who could get more out of this experience. I'd say mission accomplished. Well, mission accomplished. There's a nice feat to Zubat. Point. Because he may win MVP and Defensive Player of the Year, Mike. <laughs> yes. Zubats. I'd rather do that than give up bacon. <laughs> here, here. <laughs> Leonard for three. That's good. Jokic and Green again trying to back down, kicks it out. Murray gets a wide open look. Six three pointer of the game for Denver. Porter, nice feed. Wow. Boy, beautiful look for Porter and Jokic able to finish. That's a, that's a big time delivery under pressure. Reggie Jackson starting in place of Patrick Beverly, still out with that calf injury with George Zubats, Leonard. And Marcus Morris, Kawhi Leonard now with 16 points. Mom, I'm going home soon, but I just wanted to be a part of this. I knew it would be historic. I knew it would be unprecedented, and I wanted to be here to help the guys use their platform and to, uh, to stand up and use their voices. They had to overcome. It's just unprecedented. Jokic across the lane, gets it into Porter for the finish. That's seven assists.
Jackson. Oh, he thread the needle there. Zubats, tough catch in traffic and finish. Denver's lead cut to two. Murray bodies up. Inside the Millsap was off balance, couldn't get it to go. And here comes Leonard. Leonard makes his drive all the way, coast to coast, and switches, finishes with a left hand. 20 points for Kawhi Leonard to lead all scores. Paul George gets another good look. That one goes down. Just his second three-pointer. But uh, Marcus Morris, nice turnaround shot. Shard. After having a career year scoring-wise with the Knicks early in the season, acquired mid-season, nice feed inside. So he, he must, they, they just, if you're his teammate, you must just love playing with him. Paul George now, that's back-to-back -back threes. He started one for six, but he's hit two in a row. The NBA to have defensive success, and it's obviously something you can't work at. So the defenses are behind the offense because of that, which I thought was interesting as Zubats banks at home. Leonard with the steal goes at Zubats and lays it up and in with the left hand. But they get, they get it done quickly. Jermichael Green is in. Lou Williams checked back in. Jokic, nice sweet jumper. Jamal Murray looking for a boy. He wanted to post up Reggie Jackson. Now Murray gets it inside. Feeds Grant. Nice look. Count it and the foul. Uh, just the passing contagious. Jamal Murray, you're right. All tied up. As we approach two minutes left here in the third, Paul George over Plumlee nails the th three. One for six, he's hit all three of his threes here in the third. 11 points in the quarter for George. Grant catches, foul, and one. George finds Lou Williams. Williams for three. Lou Williams lighting it up here. He's got 18 now, and we're tied again. Wow. Grant. <laughs> My goodness. One point about Jeremy Grant with what coach said. Like, I, I think Michael Porter Jr. changes the calculus for and can consistently get to this level. That would also change the calculus. No doubt as George throws that one down back to a one point game. A couple of things out of the gates early. He, he's got to know the personnel he's guarding. Like Lou Williams, you don't fall for an <laughs> up fake, right? And the ESPN app. Boy, I just feel like they can't catch a break, Houston. My goodness gracious. Slow start with his new team has just been fantastic. Grant, that's a three. Jeremy Grant once again. That's his fourth three-pointer. Lou Williams scoots inside, kicks it out. Patrick Patterson for three. Uh, Mike Malone calls timeout. Marcus Morris for three. That's his first three-pointer. He was 0 for 5. Grant, feet inside to Dozier. Good find by Jeremy. He's got 25, as you said, Mike. Paul George finds room and the foul. Stronger than you think. Leonard. Nice move inside once again, Bates jump. That will be a heck of a series. By the way, congratulations to Nate McMillan. Yeah. Got a one-year contract extension as Paul George knocks down that. It's back up to 10. Nuggets down a dozen. Troy Daniels has come in. HD up. Floats it up. Out. And he'll just and he'd just be so dominant if if he didn't see any double teams. He's just so crafty down low. So that would be a fun matchup. As the Clippers with a terrific second half, Paul George exploded after a rough start scoring.